Us. All right, cool. All right, so we got we got Sue and Paradox. Yeah, Paradox has been uh, talking about making the switch over to being a Puff main. I've actually played it. I, I like it a lot. Yeah, I think I mean it's a better character. Uh, his nest is pretty solid. Yeah, but, uh, his nest he has a lot of problems with uh, dropping combos and everything like that, and a lot of SDs. It's a tough character because the recovery is super tricky. Yeah, recovery is super tricky and like you need to be on point doing the combos. With Puffet, there's a little bit more leniency. And Although, then, I would say another re recovery where you need to know what you're doing. Yeah, like, no, for sure. If you waste your jumps, you are close. In this matchup, a shine off stage is death. Yeah, it's probably easier to um, you know, count jumps and everything like that than always have like the precise angles for Ness. Right. Um, yeah, like, I, think, see, I think he used too many jumps there. And yeah, he got hit kind of low. I'm not he sure what did. he's supposed to do there. He did, but it was a little bit after he uh, he went off stage. A little bit. That's a very good pivot. Uh, that's trouble. He can get back, but oh, uh, that was meant to get. Yeah, like a rising upward. Hmm. That's okay. It's a little flub. I like the down smash he had. I'm just wondering what he should put out instead. I'm, I'm guessing ooh, wrong way, but still gonna uh, kill. Hopefully, Wispy doesn't start blowing. He's looking like he might. <laughs> He, oh, was was thinking, he was thinking about it. Do you grab? Up air? Press? Yeah, no. Not I'm... enough upwards DI to get out of the combo there. I, I like Paradox being a tough name. I think he'll probably have more consistent results this way. Yeah, um, absolutely. It might be a bit of a transition, but I mean, he looks pretty good. Yeah, no, it's like... This is only week two. So. Pretty solid for coming into it. Yeah, I think I played him his like first week of doing it, and it worked out. Yeah, he also he got practice with Kiro um, playing oh, yeah, on Netplay. Net play, yeah. You're probably able to play. Uh, kill? Yeah. Do it. Good game though. Uh, yeah, very he, close. He almost ran that back. Yeah, Paradox uh, kind of came from behind there. And good, like, good, good. Yeah, no, I think he was playing really well. Can't can't get too hard on yourself over that. No, especially after a, a switch. Yep, yeah, it's like the both things there. I, I want to see. I wonder what their matches normally look like when uh, Paradox is just playing Ness. Uh, I mean, I can't imagine it goes very well because Fox has all sorts of tools to destroy Ness's already poor recovery. Yeah. Shine is devastating. Yeah, the, the, the source, if you want to see how that works, is just watch your match at. Shine against that one kid. Shine. Yeah, he's a Smash 4 player. Though. I mean, I feel a little bad. <laughs> a little bit. He walked into the wrong part of the venue. Yeah. He heard four. He thought it was it. Yeah. He just he missed the six. <laughs> oh, oh, that wow. was brutal. And that's it. Good stuff from Stu. Yeah, I'm thinking some. I'm thinking some with that recovery is like Paradox might have wanted to put out a pound instead of doing jump there because at least you have a hitbox in front of you. Yeah, it's good. It's, you'll get more trades that way. Uh, it's it's still rough. I mean, Puff's recovery is not great. Um, yeah, you got a lot of jumps, but uh, that's about it. Yeah, exactly. Don't I, some jumps start losing height for you? Uh, I don't know if they lose it, but they certainly don't gain it. <laughs> I know. I know the first two jumps are the only ones that really. Matter. Yeah, Stu just saved him right there. See, he used too many jumps there as Stu was waiting. He should have been pounding for the stage. Yeah. That, that How precise sick. is the angle for a uh, rising pound? I honestly don't know, but I assume that's why he keeps getting the same. Yeah. That he's trying to do rising pound. Like, maybe it's not just, like, put it in the top right gate. Maybe it's got to be a little bit lower. The way that I always do it when I when I do mess around with puffs is that I will pound and then immediately hit up after. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't really... I, I don't want to risk this thing. Yeah, you can, can you like buffer the direction or something? I think you can kind of like hold to the side and kind of do it right. Yeah. So S Stu took that. I mean, yeah, game two is a little more convincing, but uh, I don't know. I like the switch to Paradox. I think that's going to be uh, Yeah, both of those games, they had the same kind of flow at the start where... <sighs> what am I trying to say? Where Paradox was kind of getting caught in a lot of um, situations that were just killing them really early. And then he started to compose himself, and then he started to bring it back. Right. But I think I think he kind of uh, 
he got caught using his jumps a little bit, and then that would result in stuff like uh, Stu just taking jumps with lasers. Yeah, Stu, Stu was being very smart with it, the way he was taking it. And if Paradox uses one jump, gets lasered, one jump, gets lasered, 